In Office 365, I'm going to show you how to apply a new Outlook web app policy. Now, in a previous video, I showed you how to create one, but now I'm going to show you how to apply it to a user so it will actually affect a user. So once we're logged into Office 365, make sure you click on the admin icon, assuming you have those rights, and then go ahead and, and click on that, and you'll, it will take you to this Office Admin Center. Once you're there, we need to go to the bottom left-hand icon and choose Exchange from the Admin Centers. Once we click on that, it'll take us to this next page where we're going to click on Recipients. So we're going to take one of our recipients and we're going to double-click on it, and we're going to give Jane a new Outlook Web App policy. Let's go ahead and go to Mailbox Features. And from here, we'll scroll down to where it says Email Connectivity, View Details. And there's our default policy. So if we click Browse, we can find our new policy that we created in the other video. And we'll click on that, click Save, Save again. And now Jane has this new policy. So Jane's policy is going to be different from anybody else's policy. So she may or may not have the same features depending on what boxes were checked. So if you want to know more about the Outlook web policies, I recommend you check out that video in this playlist. So that's how you apply an Outlook web policy in Office 365.